Hello everybody, and welcome to Silent Plays Pitch Black. This is a Game Jolt uh, RPG horror game that I've had my eye on for quite a while, actually. And I need to do a quick explanation thing before I jump into this. First things first, Bass, uh, Stargazer Abishant, you know, dude that I absolutely fucking love. It's my bro right there. But... You guys didn't see it, but I kind of did like the whole peace sign after pounding chest twice gangster thing, yo. But, um... You might get a little bit irritated when you do see this, but I forgot when I had announced in the video log that I had just put up that... See, I had an agreement with Stargazer a while ago, folks, that I just completely forgot about actually until five seconds ago, where I wasn't going to put anything up on this video until he was done, anything up on this game, until he was wrapped up with the game. And honestly, I can't really, like, I thought about it afterwards and I'm like, shit. But I kind of can't really, like, go back on that now, I don't think, because I had, like, already put up a fucking video log where that was the thing that I was going to do. So, I'm just gonna have to go through this with a grain of salt, then I guess if that's the way to word it properly, I'm just gonna need to go through it slower than I would ordinarily with a game, so I'm not gonna like fly through it all at once, and I'll do other things as well, dude, so... Just for the other shits as well, uh, annotation right up on the top for you guys to go ahead and view Stargazer's Pitch Black. Fucking excellent job with that. But... Yeah, so that was the thing that was supposed to go on with that, and I had completely forgotten about it until now, but, uh, yeah. Another thing, too, folks, just breathe in that beautiful menu music, by the way. Fuck yes. So we're gonna go ahead and start a new game, then, so I've stalled enough of your time. I also need to move this really quick, so hold on. I need to see what my recording time is while I'm doing this. We're not going to skip the credits, we're just going to watch right through them. I did a volume test this time, guys, so I hope that like my voice isn't too overbearing, but... I may or may not rip that theme and use that as the ending theme from the uh, Library of Sounds. I haven't decided yet. Anyways, so yeah, uh, I want to also take a look at the scripts that they were using there too. I want to know what was used during this. I know the Kaz awesome lights effect though, that shit's awesome. Alright. I'm so excited, you made it! I thought you wouldn't come. Dots. I'm sure you're gonna like the story. Oh, okay, I forgot that it was supposed to be narrated. Well, tonight's story tells us about an unfortunate chain of events, all orbiting around a certain high schooler. <laughs> Sorry. The girl's name is Claire. She's special. I should say that in this case, it wasn't a good thing. But enough intro. Let's begin, shall we? This one's called Pitch Black. Definitely a good storytelling atmosphere, which I fucking love when it comes to this kind of stuff. Hey, class representative, quotes, enlighten me. I'm gonna need to do a volume test on that shit earlier into the episode to make sure that it wasn't overbearing on my voice. I don't think it is, though. Louis Ferru presents 
pitch black. Why in the world haven't we decided what to do yet? I represent the class. I won't make that decision by myself. I've been asking everyone about it, but you can guess. Oh, and you can guess how that went. Bystander effect. The festival? Yes. I'm sure I'll have to answer to the student council soon. Yeah, sucks to be you. Nice dick. Dots. Huh? We're all at fault here, jackass. Dude, what's your problem? You are the problem. Ooh, shots fired. Don't worry about me, I'll manage. Dots. By the way, guys... Have you heard the rumors? Yeah, ghost story. Okay, corpse party shit. Let's do this. Oh, yeah. It's pretty difficult not to hear about it. It's crazy. What rumors? As clues as ever, Mako. And cute. Wink, wink. Well. There are rumors going around about a demon kidnapping people. They say it stalks you and takes you straight to hell. Fuck the other layers of the earth in between, you know, just straight to hell. Needless to say, everyone's freaking out. They've heard it kills you right away and eats your soul. There are multiple stories, but there's something that never changes. Once gone, you're gone for good. Have you seen the news lately? There are four missing. People say those are its victims. Even Aki disappeared. What? Aki's not missing. He is a Hikokomori. Which, those of you... I don't know if Bass had put that in his video or not, though, but Hikokomori, or Hikikomori, however you're supposed to pronounce that, I don't know, Japanese. But, basically a shut-in. Anybody who's played Yume Nikki, that's basically what a... What a thing is! But yeah. Oh. That explains... Then three missing. Hey, I saw that heart. Giggle. Oh, Mako. You don't need to worry. Really? Why? Coffee break. You see, people say it cannot get you if you're accompanied by someone. You walk home with your little brother, so you're safe. You should have started from there. Ha ha ha. Dick. Ayumi? Are you telling ghost stories again? Reference to Corpse Party. Fucking knew it. I knew it. I knew it a million fucking times. That was a Corpse Party reference right there with the whole blue-haired girl and Ayumi. Fucking thumbs up to that one. You say it like it's the only thing I do. That's true. Whoa, calm down. What are we going to do about the festival? Two days, guys. Yeah, they're talking about like a festival and everything. This is the most obvious corpse party reference I've ever fucking seen. Two days. I thought it was seven days. Well, about that. Okay, everybody. Back to your seats. I'm loving the rainbow of fucking hair colors in this classroom. Jesus, it's like a fucking painter's palette. Does it say Akagi-chan? I can't really tell from the text. I think it's Akagi-chan. Dots. Akagi-chan! Akagi-chan! Yes? Someone's looking for you. I'm coming. Thank you. 
we have some Kawaii Desu into the mix. So, how was it? Dots. It was awfully difficult. Oh. But I did well. All thanks to you. Thank you, Fan. Well, study sessions do work. I would be hopeless without you. <coughs> uh, that crept up my throat right there. <coughs> okay. Don't mind me, I'm just dying. That's not entirely true. You just lack a bit of concentration. Dots. Don't give me all the credit. Basically me. Fucking lacks lots of concentration, but, you know, whatever. You worked hard as well. Maybe. Let's go, then. We are running out of break time. Yep. Dots. Claire? Hmm? Is everything alright? Yes. It's felt weird all of a sudden. It's probably because a ghost slapped your ass. <laughs> weird? Yeah. Doesn't sound good. Maybe you're getting sick. Let me check. Wait. Ah! Nice, there was totally some animations with the sprites there. Dots. Dots. Well, no fever. More dots. Even so, let's go to the infirmary. Just to make sure. I should count the number of dots in this uh, text sequence right here. Don't worry. I'm okay. It's just for a moment. Hmm. You sure? Yep. Alrighty. Maybe it's hunger kicking in. Let's go get lunch. Maybe that'll help. Let's go! I'm loving the whole red eyes on, like, brown hair thing. It's reminding me of Eve as well. I know this game has quite a few references to other RPG horrors and shit. Let's go! I'm right behind you. Are you? Are you really? Because you don't look right behind her. Use the arrow keys to move, Z to accept, X to back. Okay, yeah, I know this. Use an item, press A. Talk to people to find out more about the backstory, or follow the arrows to continue to the main story. Game ends with a thanks for playing message. Only then you'll know it's over. If you forget, there's a tutorial in the item menu under texts. This is an early demo. Many things will change in the final release. Picture gallery updated. Why not? And then that is how you open that up, yep. And I think this is how you use things on yourself. Yep. But yes. There's totally a picture gallery with a bunch of random shit in here. Actually, just for the lols, for a fucking edit later on, this must be done. Just zoom in slowly on her chest right there, Barry. Okay, that's enough of that. Bulletin board. Join the Miss Club. We all we accept all genders. We all accept genders! Club president, Nishizono Ayako. I'm assuming the Ayako is the first name. The student council encourages students who are not yet inscribed in a club to do so. It's important to know how to relate to people. Interactions will prepare you for your future careers in life. I personally recommend the Young Strategists Club. To learn how to overpower your enemies and efficiently control your allies will prove absolutely useful in adulthood. Wow, that uh, escalated quickly. And yes, I am going to interact with everything in this room. You can click the annotation right there if you want to skip the shit. Student Council Vice President, Shibuya Ryota. Ryota. I fucked that one up. I had that 
perfect with the pronunciation, too, and then I fucked it up. I recommend the Music Club. I think music is the purest form of expression there is. Just to listen to those beautiful melodies and realize those are people's emotions make me feel butterflies. This guy knows what it's at. Student Council President Fei Lin. Fan fucking tastic. Another thing that I should also note too, I'm seeing it over on the corner, is this isn't supposed to be in uh, 720p, so it's going to look odd and stretched with the resolutions and shit. Students are no longer allowed to get to the roof. Roof access. All right, roof access doors will be locked at all times, including lunch. The lack of a second S there kind of screwed me up. No more lives will be lost, at least not in that way, management. Well then. Because of the recent earthquakes experienced on the region, we encourage students to stay alert and keep in mind the things to do in case of an earthquake. Keep calm and stay where you are. Most injuries during an earthquake occur when people decide to enter or exit the buildings. If you are indoors, take cover under a desk, table, or bench, against an inside wall or a solid heavy frame doorway. And hold on, stay away from glass, windows, outside doors, or walls, and anything that could fall and hurt you. Hold on and move along the desk as it slides, or brace yourself in a central hallway or against an interior wall. Why am I reading this? If you're in a stairwell, sit down, hold on, okay, we got it, we got it here, we got it. Just a normal plan, I can investigate everything in this room. And there is totally eight directional movement in here, too. Good work on that one. Oh my gosh. Hanako-san is real. A friend of me told Hanako-san appeared to her. I've got to try it myself. How was it? You say Hanako-san three times in front of a mirror, right? Never heard of that before. Probably their version of Bloody Mary. I had this awful dream last night. I was in this weird pink world talking to cute animals and then... Oh wait. Never mind. I forgot. <laughs> oh god. In my class, we are going to make a maid cafe. I'm super excited. I really like cosplay. As a maid? Yes. I heard someone fell from the roof last month. People say she may have cursed the school. She didn't die, though. What am I doing with my life? I don't know, what are you doing with your life, fool? Just coming and going from home to school and back. Is that what high school is all about? Oh, man. Excuse you, I'm busy. Well, fuck you too. Dots. What am I gonna do? Hmm. We will think of something. We are screwed. <laughs> like a light bulb, my friend. Dude, just. Dude. Hardcore crazy, man. Okay. Oh, he's bald, okay. <laughs> People is actually disappearing out there. Saw it on the news this morning. All the girls. It's not a psycho pervert. Probably. After the festival, my friends and I will most likely end up cleaning the mess. I'm going to be talking to everyone here, by the way, folks, so I may or may not skip through this, but I want to get all the picture gallery shit. I'm still a little shaky from the story. It's not a bad thing. It's one of your traits. Okay. I don't know how to interpret that. Falling asleep. Shouldn't have stayed up late. That new season of Index, though. Really great food in our cafeteria. It's food for all tastes. Heard it's not like that in other schools. Lucky us, I guess. I love art. I went to this crazy art gallery the other day. Blew me away with the Gwentenna. Dude. <laughs> Eve. Yes. Gwentora. Gwentenea. I forget I said anything. Definitely Eve right there, that reference. Guertenna, I believe, was the word you were looking for, friend. I'm really excited about the festival coming up. We have a good student council this year. Not like last year. Ugh! I like the uniforms. Different levels have different tie colors. First year uses blue, second year uses green, third year uses red. Can't wait to be a senior. I should join a club. Maybe tomorrow. Or maybe not. Who knows? Okay. Done. I'll wait for you at the table over there. Okay. Don't keep me waiting, please. I added in the please. Excuse me? Hello there, Missy. What would you like today? I guess curry? Sweet curry. Okay, just a second. Here you go. Bon appetit. Thanks! 
I love the little spiral pirouette thing she just did. Am I supposed to be sitting? Yeah, okay. So... How are you feeling now? Fine. Really. Songer after all. Fame. I feel like I'm always worrying you. Sorry. Dots. It's not like that. You know I worry because I care about you. You are very important to me. There's going to be some lesbianism going on here, hopefully. Yes, yes. In the wise words of Stargazer Abishad, friendshipping is the best shipping. Anyway, besides... Worrying is something that comes with friendship. Friendshipping is best shipping. Worrying is something that comes with friendship. You can't just stop doing it. Yeah, but... No buts. No buts! Alright, well this is gonna get a very... This is gonna be a very boring RPG horror then without buts. Okay. It's sad. What is... Graduation. I'll miss all of this. Dots. I'll miss you. I'll miss you too. Dots. So many dots! That weird feeling. It was that, right? Dots. Yeah. I'm sorry, I can't help you with that. Wish I could. Don't worry, don't worry. It's never hurt me before. Hmm. Alright. Blue haired dude! President? Ryota? What's wrong? Came to tell you something about the meeting today may take longer than expected. Ryota, that was the dude that was on the thing, was it not? I don't know. Bat backwards everything, Barry. Yeah, all of that shit. What? Why? There are some classes that haven't decided what to do yet. How's that? I... I should have been more strict. I'm sure it's not your fault. You did a great job. It's those lazy idiots of 1A. Their laziness is spreading to other classes. It's the reason why we'll have to stay longer. We have to stop, uh, we have to help them and other classes decide. I see. We let our guard down. Do you think? Hmm. Never mind. Dots. Well, that's it. I'll go now. Gotta check on those slackers of 1A. President? Akagi-kun. Bye. Bye. Isn't that the most uptight-looking asshole character that you have ever seen? What time is it? Oh, adventure time? Tell me it's adventure time. Break is almost over. Are we done? Yep. I'm gonna wait until the exposition's over before I move on to the next episode, folks. Claire. Oh, hey. Hey. Club activities? Yep. For a while. Why? I... I... I mean... We are walking home together, right? I would love to. But... You have a meeting, right? Yes. It'll start in a couple of minutes. Dots. I'll be here for two more hours. Really? Yep. Alright then. See you at the entrance? I'll be there. Foreshadowing is coming. Me thinks Claire's going to be the one that gets spirited away next. Shh! Ryota. President? Can I ask you a question? Go ahead. Do you know for how long we'll be here? Can't take us more than two hours, right? Dots. No clue. It's quite a lot to discuss. More than two hours seems very possible, in my opinion. I see. Thanks. Dots. That's why I could never be part of, like, this kind of a thing. I tried it before when I was in college. I just, I don't know. I didn't like the pointless conversations about nothing that took way longer than they needed to fucking be. Ugh. Oh, let's begin.
Riona? Yeah? I need to go. Go. Claire, she's waiting for me. Are you sure that's a good idea? The representatives and teachers won't accept anyone but the president. I'm sure she can get home by herself just fine. That's not it. Then? Dots. I understand she's your childhood friend, but this meeting is critical to the success of the festival. You know that, right? I'll go tell her you can't go today. I know she'll understand. It's normal for the president to be busy. Wait! Ryota. President? Yes? That sounded like tripping rather than a doorway opening, but that's okay. She said it was okay. Shit's going down. I... I'm sorry. I can't. Hmm? President, wait. What the? Earthquakes! Okay, this looks like a fantastic time to leave off on, folks, so I'm going to go ahead and do that right here and do my outro. Pretty interesting uh, uh, exposition here. I actually forgot a pretty good amount of that from when I had seen Bass go through it, but, uh, you know, whatever. So, I think we get into gameplay right after this, which is pretty neat, so I'm going to go ahead and cut out here and maybe move on to the next one. Not sure. But, uh, yeah, take it easy, guys. Catch you in the next one.